this coin is the single most important element of the 2023 NFL season. You might just say, hey, it looks like a normal coin. It acts like a normal coin. That may be right, but this coin will be determining the fate of every single NFL team this year. I am starting a new series here or continuing it, you know, doing what I do. And we're going to be predicting every single NFL game and the playoffs and crowning a Super Bowl champion with this coin of fate. How's it going, everybody? I am Jason of Jason's Realm here. And today I'm here once again with the quarter of fate. You know what that means. Flip a fate video. Let's dive into this. Heads are home team wins, tails are away team wins. Let's go to week nine predictions right now. All right, starting off on heads as we always do with the Tennessee Titans going to Pittsburgh to take on the Steelers. And the Steelers get the win there. Up next, we have the Miami Dolphins going to Kansas City to take on the Chiefs. Oh, there we go. That's another heads. That one for the Chiefs. Up next, we have the Minnesota Vikings going to Atlanta to take on the Falcons. And the Vikings get the win. Up next, we have the Seattle Seahawks going to Baltimore to take on the Ravens. And the Seahawks get a win. Up next, we have the Arizona Cardinals going to Cleveland to take on the Browns. It's a spinner, and the Browns get the win. Up next, we have the Los Angeles Rams going to Green Bay to take on the Packers. And the Packers get a win. The Rams falling behind in the NFC West. Redemption game here for Houston as they are at home taking on the Buccaneers. And it did land heads for Houston. Next, we have the Washington Commanders going to New England to take on the Patriots. And the Commanders master the Patriot way with a win. Up next, we have the Chicago Bears going down to the Big Easy to take on the Saints. And the Bears get a win. Up next, we have the Indianapolis Colts going to Carolina to take on the Panthers. And the Colts get a win there. A big win for the AFC South. Up next, we have the New York Giants going to Vegas to take on the Raiders. And the Raiders get a win. A big needed win for them too. Up next, we have the Dallas Cowboys going to the Philadelphia Eagles. This game, a critical game for both parties. But the Eagles get the win. Up next, we have the Buffalo Bills taking on the Baltimore Ravens in Baltimore for a Ravens win. And before we get to the last one in this video, remember I will be giving you guys a recap of the week after this flip. And we will go through and take a look at the standings. Not to mention we will take a look at the current playoff seeding after this week as well. But right now this flip for the Los Angeles Chargers versus the New York Jets in New York. And the Chargers get the win. The Jets fall to 0 and 8. All right, I did just realize we did have one small error in the game here. So if Buffalo does not play Baltimore this week. Buffalo plays Cincinnati. So Cincinnati got the win against the Bills, not the Ravens. I know you guys probably know that because, well, the Ravens can't play twice. I didn't catch that. My bad. All right, so here is our recap for Week 9. For all the teams that have a green uh, bar next to their name, they won. Teams that do not have that green bar took an L this week. Pause if you'd like to take a look at that. But let's go ahead and jump now over to the standings. So as you can tell here, the AFC East really in a tight race for the top three. Don't want to move those. AFC North, another tight race. All of these races are fairly tight. The biggest anomalies are the Jets at 0-8. The Eagles way ahead at 7-2 in a tight race with Dallas. Uh, you see a basically a two-team race in the uh, NFC North now forming. Same with the NFC South. And the NFC West is all below 500. But now let's go ahead and take a look real quick. And I believe I am covering it. Yes, I am. But you can see right here the current playoff picture. And it looks like if the season ended right now, it would be the Chiefs, the Bengals, the Jags, the Dolphins, the Chargers, the Texans, and the Raiders on the AFC. And the NFC would be the Eagles, the Vikings, the Saints, the Rams, the Cowboys, the Panthers, and the Bears on the NFC side. You can see where everyone stands here. The Jets really not looking good. Can be eliminated here in a few weeks. The Chiefs not really close to clinching anytime soon, though, either. The closest team to clinching will be the Eagles right now, and that's about it. Well, I guess that's about going to do it for me today. If you guys did like, don't forget to smash like and subscribe. It helps me out a whole lot. Let's know you guys like the content and I should keep doing what I'm doing. Also, while if you missed a chance to or miss a video on this series, go ahead and click down there in the playlist, which will be the entire Flip of, Fla or Flip of Fate series playlist for this year. And I guess with that, I will see you guys later. Peace out and have a good one.